Clara Rockmore. One day in Russia, a four-year-old girl stood on a table and started playing the violin. Her name was Clara and she was auditioning for St. Petersburg Conservatory. Clara was a child prodigy and she had her heart set on becoming a famous violinist. After the Russian Revolution, though, Clara's parents decided to flee the country. They undertook a difficult and dangerous journey that was partly paid for by concerts given by Clara and her sister along the way. By the time they reached New York City, Clara had developed a weakness in her arm that forced her to abandon the violin. She was heartbroken. Before long, however, Clara saw something miraculous, an instrument that could be played without being touched at all. The performer stood in front of an electronic deck and waved her hands between two antennas. Her movements were picked up by the device and transmitted as music, like a magician weaving a spell. The strange new instrument was called a theremin for its inventor, Leon Theremin. I can play the air, said Clara. It's so beautiful. The theremin was hard to play, but she was a natural. She became a pioneer of electronic music and the world's most famous theremist. Her hands floated over the theremin and the sweetest, most enchanting melodies materialized out of thin air. Leon Theremin fell in love with Clara. He made her a birthday cake that spun and lit up as soon as she got close to it. He proposed to her many times, but Clara never married him.